Hello YouTubers, today I will be bringing you yet another LEGO creation. This, as promised in my last video, is my version of Megatron. Now, uh, his gun mode's uh, different. Um, it's kind of like uh, some of the side brand toys where uh, I couldn't really figure out how to make his legs together to be the handle, so one of them folds up to here and becomes the front as the other becomes the handle. Now, um, loosely his robot mode is based off of G1 Megatron, kind of. Uh, it looks pretty similar. So, uh, that's what I was going for, and it really turned out pretty much exactly how I wanted it. Uh, there are, uh, gaps in the midsection, but I couldn't really avoid it at this scale. Um, but I still think it looks, uh, pretty cool as a gun. Um, I, it's like some sort of futuristic pistol. So, uh, anyways, to get started, uh, we'll take off his scope, which will, uh, become his, uh, arm cannon and set that off to the side then we fold his arms up all the way up and uh, just collapse his legs down this midsection then rotates around and centers uh, about right there and we'll move on down to the legs we'll rotate this leg around and drop it down um, now this leg is a little bit different than the other one. Uh, it's got more transformation. So, uh, I mean, they look identical, but they're not transformation-wise. So we spin that section, the back of the heel down, and then we fold the foot down inwards so it's about there. Then we take, uh, then we take this whole section here and rotate it upwards. So we can then take this section rotate that around and then rotate it around again at that clip joint there and there we go we can then carefully rotate this section down sometimes at this point it falls apart on me luckily it has not murphy's law i got you there uh so this section is a whole lot easier there's not as much transformation going on there's like one step less so, uh, oop, there we go. So we rotate this right here, this piece up. It becomes his shin, or his uh, knee guard. And then we take his uh, toe or foot, whatever you wish, wish to call this bit, and rotate it down and around like that. So then, like the other foot, we do this. But instead of rotating that piece, we're just going to rotate it at the clip there like so and then we bend or uh, we rotate this section all the way back around I'm sorry if you didn't see that it didn't look like it was in frame uh, so there are his legs they're all set then we could take his arms uh, kind of rotate them around rotate the hand around here and get at like a, a good position or so like that same as the other side spin the hand around get it in a nice position bend down and there's the head we just pull the head up and rotate it around and we give him his arm cannon and there we have my version of Megatron in his robot mode. And like I said, uh, he was based off of the G1 Megatron in his robot mode. And I think it came out uh, very well. It came out pretty much exactly as I wanted it. Uh, it's very nicely proportioned. And uh, size comparison wise, I'll bring in the other creation from my verse here is Optimus Prime now um uh one thing that I did kind of backwards was now Optimus is a little bit bigger than Megatron that's supposed to be uh the other way around but uh it doesn't really bother me because they're pretty closely scaled and that's what I was going for here so they can kind of be like 
nemesis wise uh, so we'll take him back out and uh, so yeah that's a that's about it uh, I'll try and post more content I had like builders block for a little bit there but I'm working it out and uh, so yeah uh, like subscribe comment down below and I'll see you guys next time.